Dela Wright, my envies. Welcome. Report reaching us right now and rumor making the rounds on social media is that the only of Ife wives, you know, are being led by Olori Toby, have decided to get a restraining order against um, his sharing, you know, um, uh, method because of the fact that uh, we recently heard or oh, there is this recent um, development where they said he will a mini estate to Olori Naomi um, just to, you know, um, make her stay and wait until, you know, everything is done. Now, we have heard on um, several locations that he has given a lot of stuff to Queen Naomi, um, including houses, um, real estate, um, uh, uh, companies, like the other one that said it was an oil war. We've heard that he has bought a house recently in Dubai for her. We heard about the uh, royal mansion that they say is about the biggest of everything. And, you know, we've been hearing time and time again about a lot of things that he has been doing for Olori Naomi, basically for Tade Nikawu, but he is doing this um, uh, from what people are saying to ensure that Queen Naomi stays and Queen Naomi waits until he is ready to fix everything. So right now, um, only recently we had a report that started making rounds on social media that a man had come up to propose to Queen Naomi. And um, before that, they said Queen Naomi was beginning to lose interest yet again in everything that has been happening between himself and the, I mean herself and the Oni of Ife. Now, um, Oni of Ife started, you know, having this urge to run against time to ensure that he keeps his wife Queen Naomi to himself. And they said that was the reason why he wield this mini estate um, yet again to Olori Naomi to Tadeni Kawo. And now you do know that it's not like before we are Olori Naomi was the only um, mother to um, a, a boy child for um, um, the only of effect. Uh, right now, Olori Toby has um, a boy child and um, there is a princess. So it is only natural that we begin to get all of these kinds of reports about um, people not being comfortable with some of the decisions that the only of effect is taking because naturally the women are thinking that he is our husband and there shouldn't be this level of marginalization um, amongst us that what is good for the goods is good for the Ganges. And so um, 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 he needs to be fair, he needs to be just, and whatever he's given to Lori Naomi, he should understand that we are all together seven right now married to him. So right down the said that it was Olori Toby who has been very unhappy about certain things that have been happening. Every effort to try and make things straight, making Oni to understand that she has children now for him. It's, it doesn't have to be about Queen Naomi all the time and Queen Naomi all the time. They said Oni has um, paid deaf ear and so she is leading this group of people to unanimously you know, kind of file a suit against the only, I mean, a restraining order against the only of Ife. Now, if this information is true or not, I cannot tell you. I, I will only tell you the one thing that is true is that these are all alleged information. It's not a first-hand information. I do not live in the palace of the Oni of Ife. Neither am I related to any one of them. I am a blogger. Whatever I get, I bring it here, okay? As this is my niche, I told you I'm passionate about the Udua culture. Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Dela Ram. I bring you fresh and spicy juice from the sauce still on the Royals. How are you guys doing? I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you, my people. I love you guys. If you're yet to subscribe, kindly go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And do not forget to turn on the notification bell. And do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. Dela Wright, my Dela Wright, my Dela Wright, my super people. Dela Wright, my Dela Dela writes, my Dela writes, my super people. Thank you so much. I appreciate each and every one of you. Now, as we are hearing, know this report that is making rounds on social media is that um, um, the wives of the only of if are unanimously trying to file a restraining order against um, the sharing um, uh, method of the only of if I how is sharing um, stuff, giving everything to Queen Naomi and Tadeni Kawo, even when he has other wives and also when he has other children right now. 
Now, it is true that the older children like Viola, Ade, uh, Wamiwa, and the rest, they have no problem with it because apparently they have the best of everything. Viola has gone to the best schools ever. Ade Miwa is in the best school. And other kids, Oni is a nice man. They say he takes care of his children. He's responsible to the, to the, to the last, and he doesn't joke with his kids. But, of course... Um, this is the reason why, you know, people will tell you that polygamy is not a joke. Like, it's not a tea party affair. You don't just get up, you want to become a polygamist. Even though only of effect, a very large extent, has been able to manage these six wives so much, um, they, 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 they said that it's been a very serious buzzword. It's been a lot going on in the palace. Now, they are saying that there's a lot of marginalization in the palace. Allegedly, as we are hearing, that only of effect is focused on Queen Naomi. Everything goes to Queen Naomi. All the choice stuff that he owns goes to Queen Naomi. They say that there is nothing in this world the monarch will not do um, to ensure that he gets, you know, um, the love of Queen Naomi back. And if they continue to keep quiet like this, that uh, uh, Oni will end up giving everything that he has got to Queen Naomi and they, they will be left with nothing. But, you know, one thing that a lot of people do not know is that when a man is in love, there's nothing you can do. When you continue to push him like this, he begins to fight you. And you do know that your your strength, your powers put together, unanimous powers put together, you cannot stand the only of Ife. At the end of the day, he is a role or do do what the only of Ife, the man that cannot be questioned, can be a CEO. So... When you begin to push and want to push him um, into going by what you think rather than him standing by the decision, um, then it becomes a very big problem because this is what is going to happen at the end of the day. And if people um, really um, uh, love Olori Toby, that is if this information we are getting is the truth, uh, people should really speak to Lori Toby that um, this is not the way forward. We have seen the likes of Auntie Ikbi and the likes of Auntie Blow Blow. We see where their uh, 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 Rasmata, their, their wellings have landed them like they, nobody seemed to be happy right there in that palace. Everybody's almost as if nothing is happening. It's almost as if, you know, there's this bus bus all over. It's a wailing. So I think uh, Toby has gotten everything that um, she needs. God has blessed her so much uh, with these beautiful children for the monarch. And I think um, she needs to just focus, take care of her children and worry less of what um, Oni is giving out and what Oni is not giving out because at the end of the day is Oni's properties and at the end of the day Oni decide who and who will benefit from whatever that he has got. Now, I think that those who are in love with Toby, those who know her very well, should begin to sit her down and advise her not to follow this other senior Oloris. That is, that is if they, all the information we keep get on social media is true because um, Oni of Ife seems to be in love with Queen Naomi and there's nothing anybody can do about it. It is what it is. They saw this man, they knew he was in love with Queen Naomi and they decided to come in. The thing is that life is all about um, responsibility and accountability. When you make this kind of a drastic um, decision concerning your life, you want to understand that you, the, the decisions like this come with consequences. Are you able to stand up to the consequences of the, your decision? These are the consequences of the decisions. They, the decision they made to push Nami out of the palace and inherit her husband. And the man is still in love with Nami. There's nothing anybody can do about it. That is if all the information we keep getting is the truth. Going to bring you more updates I appreciate you so much. Thank you.